Well guys, another day, another video of me starting out in the kitchen. Again, these footage is old. Uh, if you guys saw yesterday's footage, basically I just explained that the videos you guys are seeing are basically two weeks old. Um, I'm about five videos behind right now. I'm still uploading or I'm still filming every single day. Like this morning I went thrifting. Yesterday I hit big, I went thrifting. Um, but you know, obviously I have to build up, work my way up to that. Now today's video is just gonna be nothing but thrifting content. Basically from the start of the video to the end is just me at the thrift store showing you guys the finds. No BS, no B-roll, no anything like that. It's literally just me thrifting content. Now if you guys haven't noticed, basically my videos are my intro, my outro, and then basically just thrifting. I don't do any of the B-roll. I don't do me making breakfast. Well, I show me making food sometimes, but you guys know I don't skip that bullshit just to make a 10-minute video. I try to give you guys 10 minutes of just full content of me at the thrift store, and that's what today's video is. So hope you guys do enjoy this trip to the thrift. Make sure you smash the thumbs up button. Make sure you guys follow me on DITR954. Currently, I'm running a story sale. Right now, if you stop, go on my Instagram. I have about maybe 50 items listed. Once an item sells, I upload a new item on my story sale, so we're keeping going. So far, I made about $450, and I've been doing it for about two hours now. So I've sold a lot of things, and you know, just keep it coming. This kind of makes it easier posting on my story, getting it sold versus listing it on a website, listing it on Mercari, just it makes it a lot easier. So make sure you guys go check it out, DITR954 on Instagram. Enough talking, let's get this video started. Hope you guys enjoy, let's get it guys. So I'll be honest, I don't remember the last time I walked into a Goodwill. Uh, it's been probably almost a year, but we found this Team Bieber, Bieber merchandise, little Purpose Tour 2017 little bomber jacket, $7. Uh, they resell for about 50, 60 bucks, so nice little come up. If this was at Salvation Army, it would have been $2.50. We got some shoes, so we have these Clarks, little booties. We have this super sick Walt Disney World. It actually unzips to a visor. Walt Disney tagged. We found this Miami Hurricanes little bobblehead. What else did we grab? We grabbed these swims. If you guys don't know, these are actually very expensive. They sell them at like Neiman Marcus, Nordstrom, stuff like that. They're like water shoes. Uh, they're about $100. They resell for about $40.50. Picked up a pair of Sperry's. Basically look like they're in brand new condition. Picked up a pair of Air Max. What are these? 98s? I think. 95s? 95s? And then we grabbed a Cole Haan Women little uh, wingtip zero grand shoes and then last but not least we picked up these uh, Timberlands like boots all right so let's see what clothing finds today we have this Pooh Bear the little all-over print graphic we found this Polo Ralph Lauren has a little nice patch on this side little Indian Club canoe kayak club I think I'm gonna get this for myself. Just a nice little hoodie, Hennessy. Uh, what else do we find? Gotta look this up, but uh, Chicago hot dogs, Vienna beef. Found this bootleg Gucci, little V-neck. Yankees with a little Sutter swoosh. New Rage Pokemon shirt. Probably gonna leave this though. What date is it from? It's from 2010, but it's a kids XL. Yeah, I might leave that for somebody else. This, I love the colors. And then Onita, no date. Super crazy, if only it was double-sided, but still the colors on this is so nice. Uh, we found this Ferrari Puma, little collared shirt. We found a Porsche Racing collared shirt, Porsche Motorsport. I'm gonna look it up, see if it's worth anything. This I thought was super interesting. It had like the Kappa, robe de Kappa, and it's like a Saint Tropez long sleeve. Again, gotta look that up. A lot of stuff gotta look up, and then I already showed you guys all the shoes for today. And then we found a pair of Lulu, brand new, with original tags, took off Lululemon shorts. Some finds, we have the 40s and shorties, spring summer 2017, little shirt. We have the Smashing Pumpkins, Marilyn Manson, End Times Tour 2015, CCM Panthers jersey. 
super sick Puma Ferrari all over double sided hoodie Patagonia little zip jacket Patagonia red fleece found this Six Flags Titan Texas 400 and then just a Kappa shirt. Some clothes today. So we have this Monaco Grand Prix huge racing shirt. Have this vintage Florida Gators. Super sick print. Stanley Cup 2011. I just like it because it's a big print. This old guy's rule, Muhammad Ali though. This fade on the shirt is so nice. And then on the back. And then for crew necks, found this vintage Pittsburgh Steelers pro player. The Chicago Bulls, little Bulls hit right there. And then uh, Green Bay Packers. So I went through the whole entire stuff, was about to leave with nothing, and then I literally found this whole entire group of shirts all like stacked together. It seems like someone just donated all old concert shirts, but we have this Demi Lovato 2014, double-sided. Then we found this Rascal Flats. What year is this from 2006? Rascal Flats tour. We found this Godsmack. No hit there. Found this Tate Stevens. There's a lot of country stuff. Tate Stevens 2013. We have this Rascal Flats. Tim McGraw. Tennessee River. Alan Jackson. Literally everyone's like country. Jason Aldean. Keith Urban, and then uh, is this Martina Me Bride, and then I'm pretty sure this is Insane Clown Posse, but it says uh, Psychopathic Records, and has the back hit. Well, I couldn't record it, but I just got the hookup. I got a fat bag of stuff. I'm headed home. I'll show you guys everything that I got in the bag. Paid $40 for that entire bag. I actually went and picked them up uh, two packs of cigarettes, so I'm gonna drop them back off just to say, you know, I appreciate you and uh, for looking out. But yeah, we, we hit good today. A couple more items. We have this Mitchell and Ness Notre Dame little windbreaker. Found this Velour Adidas track jacket. I might leave it. It has some stains on it. And we found this Stussy little uh, neck branding. So they just brought out some new racks. We have this old school Florida Marlins little like a uh, two button t-shirt. Then we did find this brand new with the tags 2XL Nike full track suit. The matching pants. We found this old school Rainforest butterfly shirt probably ended up leaving that I just kind of just grabbed a bunch of vintage stuff That vintage dog shirt again probably end up leaving that We did find a jersey, but I think this is like a local team Because it says James Jordan on it Then we found a few I don't know what this is Teddy fresh I got to look up a lot of stuff but We have Teddy fresh we have this, which I want to say this is Misfits. Um, Jaden, what's his name? Jaden Smith's brand, but I'm not really sure. We have another Teddy Fresh shirt. We have a Section 8 shirt. I grabbed this for myself, just a nice green essential Nike embroidered. Found this Born and Raised t shirt. Then we found this old school. Pokemon trying to see if there's a date on it. There's no date But super sick. It says let's go I also found this uh, Eastern basketball. I just love the embroidery on it. I don't know. I might leave it though It has some stains on it And then we did find this nice Yankees embroidered kind of the Jeter patch dated 2006 But I think this is definitely the find of today on the Nintendo tag Probably fits about a small medium, little side hit. 
So I just made it home, put out all the clothes. Now this is everything that I got in that bag for $40. So we started off, we have the Hard Rock Chicago. Just love the colors on it. Nice little center swoosh. It does have this football, it says Bethany, um, but it is embroidered swoosh. I thought about maybe taking that out, but I'll probably just sell it as is. It's a nice little faded black as well. We did find, I found a shirt version of this before, but now we found the sweater, the Mark Tento. It's like a Canadian guy, I believe. We have the Vintage Guest Jeans, little triangle. These are shorts, size 36. We found two brand new pairs of Champion sweatpants with the tags. They're both size large. Then for t-shirts, we did find the Cause collab with um, Peanuts. We have the 1997 Florida Marlins World Champion. We have another 1997 Marlins postseason debut. Super sick, 1982 Dolphins Super Bowl long sleeve. This shirt's insane. One of the oldest shirts I found on a vintage Logo 7, made in USA. Mortal Kombat, like tie-dye shirt, doesn't have a date on it. Brand new Stranger Things, just love the tie-dye and the double print on it. 2012 Firefighter shirt. Miami Heat Logo 7 or Logo Athletic shirt. Old school Jesus. Jesus is the season for the season. Jesus is the reason for the season. Another center swoosh um, hoodie. This is nice embroidered. It does have a little patch, but again, center swooshes do sell, so I'm sure it will go well. 2000 Yankees. We have a reprint Wu Tang. Brand new with the tags. Pack Sun joggers with like paint splats on it with the zippers on the bottom. Then we have brand new with the tags, Adidas Windbreaker. And then two duck down jackets, brand new with the tags. One in orange and then one in blue. Uh, really nice jackets. So we got all this for $40. And to be honest, those duck down jackets I'll sell by themselves for $40 a piece. And then everything else will be, I mean, I'll sell one for $40 and then everything else will be profit. So we did really good. The 1982 is insane. Uh, the center swoosh is insane. But I just need to get a list. I have so much clothes, dude. Look at my closet. I don't want to show you guys everything because I am going to be doing like a sneak peek. But I'm going to try to bulk sell these three piles. Basically, it's like probably about 150 shirts. I'm going to try to bulk sell them at 3 to $5 a piece. That is inventory I need to list. Like that's the good stuff out of this or the better stuff that's like worth listing. All that is jackets and hoodies. Up here is hoodies and jackets as well. Just so much stuff, guys. Mm -hmm.